Carrer labels Arsenal chief Josh Kroenke David Brent in damning comparison. Jamie Carrer was reminded of fictional television star David Brent during Josh Kroenke's interview about the future of Arsenal. Gunners director Kroenke, son of owner Stan, has given two rare interviews about the ownership's plans for the club, currently enjoying a run of nine games unbeaten under manager Mikel Arteta. Liverpool legend Carrer praised the 41-year-old for speaking publicly, but says Kroenke and Co's actions will be more important than their words. I think no point one, I'm pleased part of the ownership, has come out and spoke, the ex-England centre-back said on Sky Sports as Arsenal welcomed Watford in the Premier League on Sunday. Not just Arsenal, I'd like to see that from a lot of other clubs. I really applaud the interview with Jeff there. There was a little bit of David Brent in it. Vision. Strategy. For me they're just words. When you talk about what happened at the end of our scene Wenger's time, when they talk about we went out of the top four, we need to re-evaluate. Why were they not re-evaluating when they were in the top four? They weren't challenging for the league for a very long time. Carrer added, they took it for granted that they were in the Champions League. That was a cash cow for them. Now they're not in the Champions League, there's this desperation to get back in there, I understand that. You then throw money at it to try and achieve to get back in there. You talk about then that will attract better players to challenge for the league. Can Arsenal succeed under Kroenke? Let us know your thoughts below. But under their ownership, they've been in a position where they were in the Champions League and they never challenged for the league. So that for me will be the proof in the pudding. When Arsenal get back in the Champions League, which they will, because they're a great and massive club, what do they do when they're there? Former midfielder Jack Wilshere, who is training with the Gunners in his search for a new club and earning his coaching badges, was also on punditry duty and has backed the club's much maligned ownership to bring back the glory days to the Emirates. They have a clear philosophy on what they're trying to do and they're sticking to it, Wilshere stated. Also the academy deserves some credit as well, you look at Buke Osaka and Emil Smith-Rowe, arguably the best performers in an Arsenal shirt this season. They didn't have to bring them in, they were developed at Arsenal. Going back to what Josh said, this is a man who cares about the club. I met him this week. He is involved in the academy. He's trying to improve things around the training ground. Who will be the best footballer in 2025? Pick yours below. The 29-year-old went on to say, I was impressed, because when I was there I never saw that side, but now I'm obviously on a bit more of a coaching role and getting more involved in the academy.